Hey, I want to make a very short review about um, something I'm using for the first time. I was not very sure about uh, this uh, acquisition, but uh, now I have it and uh, let's see how it does. It's, uh, it's a solar panel from Flex Solar. I bought it on Amazon and I just uh, set it up uh, on the ground directly. The sun is above, the time is uh, 11 um, o'clock, almost 11, it's 10 to 11. And I have my, uh, my power bank here, which it shows uh, the, the, the meter. I don't know if you can see it on the camera. Okay, how can I show it to you? It shows 37.5 watts. So, uh, in uh, very casual conditions, I can charge my uh, power bank, which is uh, 24,000. How is called milliampere hour? It's uh, saying the charging time one hour to full. Now it's sixty five percent, and theoretically it will take up to one hour. This one is uh, waterproof. You can see the dimension is like this. It comes with uh, two hanging uh, carabines. This side with the connectors. From what I understand, it's not waterproof, so I intend to to cancel it under under the tent somehow like this. I lose one. Uh, let's see how much electricity it provides just by using five of uh, the six uh, panels. Okay, come on. Actually, it doesn't charge, so I don't understand why. So now it's at 6 watts. But if you put it all the way, like this, it goes back to 37 very quickly. So I guess the first one it's very important, but the problem is you can use it just when it's uh, dry outside because it's not uh, waterproof. So let's do again the, the trial to hide it because I intend to put it under the tent. And in this position it doesn't charge all the time, it's interrupting, so I don't understand why. You see? Charging, no charging, charging, no charging. So I guess the, the last one is pretty important. Let's see if I fold it in the other direction, if, it, if it's low voltage detected, unprotected, new. So... Uh, in this position it produces 0 0.1, 11, 29, 36, 36, 0.5, steady charging. Yeah, so I have a problem with this, what I can see at the first glance. It doesn't charge without the first, uh, the first one being like this. So I need to put it in this position to charge, let's see, 36.5 watts, which is very nice. Okay, let's try to cancel one to see what's going on. 
Okay, I cancelled one. Let's see the power. Again, doesn't charge at all. Very interesting. I don't understand why. Don't think it has some folding uh, contacts here. Okay. So, again 36. Okay. I will change the position a little bit to see if I uh, if I alter the position maybe I can hang it on the tent somehow maybe it will show something different but uh, yeah very strange so from what I see they need to to be exposed all of them that means i will have a problem with the water tightness here in this area i'm not sure what i will do at the beginning i was thinking uh, just to to hanging to hang it over the tent to to fix it somewhere up the line there to put it on the side and to fold under the the bottom sheet the very end of it just to be inside and raised uh, to be able to stay upright during the rain because uh, from time to time i will living in the, in the rain like uh, when I'll go at the ABR festival, for sure I will have it outside, and uh, I don't want to to be always stressed about uh, raining on it. Last year I didn't have any drop of rain in the ABR festival, but uh, I'm not so optimistic about this year. When I was at Turatec travel event, it rained continuously for three days. So that was not the place to have something like this in place. I will, uh, I will see. I will let you know. Please leave me some comments. Cheers.